with a nice little six, seven footer here for par. This her third shot drove it in the pine straw right. Had to lay up just a little 90 yard. Did you make that up or is it true? It was close. Yeah. <laughs> we weren't exactly sure, but it looked like 90. Good chance from here, turning just a hair right. It's almost it's once in a while it's a little bit like not being on top of your game physically like you're a little bit sick so you don't have as uh, crazy high expectations. Cup Joe at eight. Very nice. She was battling migraines when she was uh, continuing to win the Augusta National Women's Amateur. A little gust of breeze feels like it's slightly in at the moment from the right. That's left 15 feet. Yeah, not happy with it. No danger there. In her brief young professional career, uh, she gave up early on it. Old Donald Russ course that uh, has had a storied history. In fact, 10 years ago, it was in danger of being developed. The city bought it and then the Doyle family. That is right down the middle. And we mentioned that Jennifer Cupcho has won. Nice putt. Cupcho. Cupcho doesn't spin the ball as much as Lexi off the driver, so into the breeze, the difference in club head speed isn't quite as obvious, although it might be here. Yeah, that one stops pretty quickly. That one was a little left and not happy again. Well, but if you miss it like that uh, most of the time, you're going to be just fine. Did eat it up very much early. So it just hit the brakes right off the putter. A few little hops. So she will remain tied for second right now, 13 under par. Yeah, little eight iron. This is right of the hole. All right, the fans know how this is going to end up. Left herself a nice putt. <laughs> she's second in total driving. She's fifth in ball striking when the putter cooperates. Cup show in the tee. Watched it closely. I lost it in the gray sky. She doesn't look thrilled with it. Oh, it's going to be in the ferry, just down the right side, or might be slightly below her feet. Oh, just fractured low. Good day, though, for Jennifer Cupcho, I and mean, she's hanging around with some of the best players on the tour. And the par five is where we find Jennifer Cupcho. Oh, perfect. Wow. Good shot. Going to be a three-shot hole today for Jennifer. Maybe even for Lexi, I would suspect. Dead into the breeze. Jennifer Cupcho's third here at the par five. 83. Won't have near the spin coming out of the grass as Lexi's did. Matter of fact, this might need just a little. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Seven iron doesn't need to lean on it too much. Wind helping and mostly from the left. Nice smooth swing. Very well struck. Drifting just a tiny bit right of the hole. 
steady has come run away quite severely over the back of this green. And that has gone a long way from the putting surface. It looked good in the air. And it produces spin as well. It's going to land into a little upslope. Got it a hair heavy. Yep, she did. And I think she must have hit 50 or 60 of those that uh, we watched. In the age of 24, incredibly. Cup show for a par. Good up and down. And for Cup Joe at 16. 139, bad kick on the tee shot. Ended up in this bunker. Clean line. Nine iron and right at it. Right at it. Jennifer Cupcho matches Lexi's birdie to stay within one of her, but Lexi. That looked like a good line. It is. Oh, a bit of a soft bounce, unfortunate. And then watch Lexi and went ahead and grabbed the putter. Got a great teach from Lexi. It's tough to get the pace right when you haven't been playing that shot. That's really good. You're chipping the ball from around the greens and then you try to putt it. Yep, no problem. Not always the best, but this has been pretty much money. Taking that up the right center, really well struck. Second on tour in total driving. Kept it left of it. It was really well struck. Yeah, I think you're right, Jerry. She needed uh, certainly part of one more club. It's a great topic of conversation amongst the uh, members here, Judy. Some love it, some not so much. Just a little heavy handed and couldn't quite take the break. Hmm. That looked like it was going to turn more. She will remain in that final group tomorrow with Nelly and Lexi.